Hi, this is Eric Martin with Boardgame Geek. I'm here with Roberto Corbelli from TV Giochi, uh, talking about Deckscape. Sure. Uh, yeah. You have your fifth title coming out, yes, Behind the Curtain. Yes, Behind the Curtain. We'll have uh, players performing magic tricks, believe it or not. So, okay. unfortunately, we cannot show much, otherwise it will spoil the fun, but uh, uh, believe me, this is going to be, uh, you know, a very fun chapter in the Deckscape line. Okay. There's nothing else to say. Uh, do you give any guidelines to Martino and and um, the and challenge? Silvano? Yeah. Well, the, the challenge with with this uh, type of uh, games is to um, deliver uh, a certain level of a puzzle, which is not too complicated, and uh, nor is too easy. So. Um, it depends really much on, uh, sometimes it depends on the people you're, you're playing with because you can have uh, a player that is uh, better at visual, another player might be better at mathematics stuff, so it's uh, the, the, um, the challenge is to, to deliver a game that will perform, uh, uh, you know, good no matter the, the group of players that it's, is facing it. And as a matter of, as a matter of fact, we don't give um, difficulty guidelines on the box because we have experience that, uh, again, you know, right. what, what might be difficult for you might be easy for me and vice versa. Right. So It's hard to quantify that yes. necessarily. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All so, right. yeah, that's the fifth title in the series, sixth one also coming. Yeah. The Curse of the Sphinx. Okay. All right, there we go. Oh, I revealed something in the box when I lifted that up. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Don't look behind the curtain. Right. Thank you, Roberto. Thank you very much.